Hello guys, uh, we'll start one more topic today um, that is um, CFG to CNF that is called uh, one of the form Chomsky norm form which is very important and uh, useful for your any um, form, any context B grammar. So some of the grammars are not in the uh, regular way of uh, using it for a language construction. So we have to be convert them, convert them into uh, convert them into CNF form. So Chomsky norm form is uh, one of the best uh, form for uh, normalizing the contest B grammar. A contest B grammar is a Chomsky norm form. If every production, if every production is one of these two forms, A gives B, C, or A gives A. So where A, B, or C are non-terminals and A is a terminal symbol. Converting CFG to CNF. Steps to convert CFG to CNF Eliminate epsilon production Eliminate unit productions Restricting the right side of the production to single terminal Or string of two or more non-terminals Final step of CNF Shorten the string of non-terminal to length 2 CFG to CNF uh, S gives AAC Right? Look at that S gives AAC A gives A, A, B or epsilon Eliminate epsilon, eliminate A gives epsilon, S gives AAC, right? So we have to follow one of the format. Here it is. Uh, first of all, you have to convert this into there is not in the CNF form, right? Here it is. It's not in the CNF form. You have to eliminate. First epsilon elimination is important. You know already how to eliminate the epsilon. So that you have to find out the A subset. So we'll get that I have to eliminate it. Is that is a um, uh, unit production? Yes, definitely it is a unit production. You have to eliminate that by non-unit production of S. So both you have to remove it. Next it is replacing all mixed string with a no, uh, solid non-terminal symbols. Right. So this is the input. This is the input. Now you have to take that. So we have to replace all the non-terminal symbol. Uh, sorry, terminal symbols by introducing um variables uh one of the variables i introduce this all color coded it here you have replaced by some other variable i introduce by one of the variable p gives a and q gives b so look at that so how do you do that which is replaced by p c then p a q and p q so then here it is p c right so now still now it is uh, uh, not in any of the uh, uh, now it is so all of them are not some still it is not in the cnf form so you have to these two are not cnf shorten the string of non terminal to length 2 how to do that i again i introduce one of the variable x1 x1 gives ac right so you have replaced that all then you can see all of them are in cnf form Right, Chomsky norm form. This way you can do unconversion. Right, and uh, we'll take this uh, one of the example. We'll see. Uh, not required there is no epsilon and unit production on this uh, replacing all mixed string with the solid non terminal so i have replaced that by you already have to do that so you can replace and step this so this is one of the example uh, second example of this you can take this example can be convert this already have done that so this is an example so we'll cover it some more example in the classroom in a detail and uh, you have to take some more example of grammar to convert them into scene form. If not possible, we'll do it in detail in the